比懂你的耶。Happy Valentine's Day, everybody! February fourteenth, two thousand twenty-three, and I'm going to wait a few minutes for people to get on, and we're going to do an update today on the veterans bathroom that we've been working on, and people have been calling in, so we want to thank everyone that has donated to the project so far. Thank you so very much. We're going to give you an update on what's happening and what we're doing、um, here in Galt, New Mexico. So, husband's here, <laughs> and we're spending our Valentines.、Um, Uh, working, and so we. This is what we do, huh? Yeah. This is the first year we haven't been in our flower shop that we、um, decided to close the doors on last year, and this is the first Valentine's we haven't been feverishly working. Right. And then, okay. So what we're going to talk about today is the bathroom. So those that are going to join us later on, we've had a number of donations、um, come in. Thank you so very much. We process those, and what we're going to do is tell you、um, where we're at now. So there's a process of. Remodeling or、um, any any kind of project that we're doing,、um, right now according to how much we've gotten so far, we've have the、um, the demoing will be covered,、um, the the lumber for the, the lumber. flooring because、um, we have to pull out the subfloor and replace it, and then also all the piping that's going to go on the floors and the fixtures that are going to come from the main water line. We're redoing all of that and we're bringing the water back in, and then the sewer going back out. So all of that is basically covered, and then we also have、um, the subfloor be put、mm -hmm. back in, the flooring. The flooring, yeah. We will also have that covered now. Thank you so very much for your、um, your contributions, and then also the toilet. So、mm -hmm. now we're going to have to look forward to because we still need help with the vanity.、Uh, we don't have enough funding for that one or the、um, the shower. Mm -hmm. So the shower pan and also the wall is what we're looking for. So if you have the means to help us out,、um, we'd really appreciate it, and we need it as soon as possible because、um, we want this to be a two-day job, three at the max,、mm -hmm. but a two-day job. We want to be able to、um, process this so they're not without a restroom for those two days. So if you have the means to help,、um, please call the number that's provided, five zero five eight seven zero three eight four four, and we can process those card payments. And if you can't,、um, text us at that number, and we'll see if we can. Figure out a way you can help、um, get your support to this gentleman. So that's what we're doing today. So we are going to be in Home Depot, and I was going to go live inside Home Depot, but they have a metal roof. Yeah. And you can't go live in there; it doesn't take it, and it just starts to cancel out, so you can't stream. We're going to meet Mr. Moore here. <laughs> He's going to probably pick out what he wants, what he need, or the 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 stuff that he needs, and then we're going to go back up to his house, and then I'm going to. Fix the、um, leaky faucet this evening for him, temporarily, of course. And you know, times are tough, and we want you to see what you can do to help us help him. And once we get that, oh, here comes another veteran. Yeah, this guy's Navy, Navy veteran. Navy vet. Look at that. He's got his hat on. Isn't that cool? See, there's veterans everywhere, and this is where you run into them here because usually husband wearing his、um, copper penny,、um, you know, t-shirts and whatever, and so he'll be in the plumbing aisle, and they always ask, "Excuse me, do you know how to do this?" And so we end up giving out business cards in the plumbing aisle because plumbers are few and far, and licensed there's plumbers. licensed plumbers, and there's. There's so many veterans inside Home Depot. That's the one thing that they really, really, really cherish is their home and what they can provide for their family and the company. <laughs> It's amazing to see how many times we come to the hardware store. We spend most of our time here. Even date days are spent here. Tommy and his lovely wife arrived early, and they found us without a problem. We got to business right away. They began looking at vanity cabinets. Husband explained the dimensions in Tommy's bathroom and explained to him what vanities would fit. Choosing showers needs careful consideration. The walls with the most curvature and reveals creates less contact against the wall. We also had to remember the shower window that was already present. Because the drain was under the old tub. It was located near the wet wall. Therefore, husband would need to move the drain to a more central location for the more modern shower pan. Toilets, due to higher utility rates and water waste, husband recommends a water-saving flush system. We also kept in mind that a higher seated toilet would be ease of use for the occupants. 
Faucets are pricey due to the components and valve systems. Husband says Moen seems to last the longest for our water mineral types in our area. Disclaimer, Moen does not sponsor our videos. We also took the time to look at a waterproof flooring system for Tommy and his wife and also paint and lighting for the bathroom. He says his bathroom has never had a vanity light and he's learned to shave in an upright tilt to catch the ceiling light. He said it would be quite something to have a vanity light. After our material adventure inside the hardware store, we followed Tommy home to fix his leaky faucet. New factoring in. Yep. Hey, what's the drywall? I think I got the right part. It's leaking on your thing. Let me see. Oh, yeah. This is the one that's. This one's leaking in here. Husband's concern is the gaskets, so he wanted to check all the shower stems, including the hot, the cold, and the diverter. To our surprise, many of the areas that are supposed to have gaskets had none. They were all missing. Tommy said he had hired a different handyman type plumber, and he was not certified, and he tried to fix the leak, and he could not do it. We are thinking he was the one that removed the gaskets and did not replace them. These shower stems are pretty complicated if you do not know what you're doing. There's two sides of it and you have to be able to put them all back together in accordance and also be able to see the gaskets, the ones that are damaged and which ones to replace them with with the right size. After regasketing all the shower stems, Hazu puts everything back together and then he turns the water back on to see if there's a leak. How's it looking? There's nothing. <laughs> well, it looks like husband fixed the leak. We temporarily did it before we have to do the demolition, but at least the faucet is not leaking. <laughs> Valentine's Day, we're fixing the shower. <laughs> 
Happy Valentine's Day, huh? Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> okay. No more leaks. Yeah. It's a super old faucet, huh? From the yeah. 70s? Just a little bit, but... It's enough, he said, it before, before it was really draining. I mean, yeah, before it was pouring out. I mean, literally pouring out. So this will sustain at least for the next week or so until yeah. we get back here to... This will do its work until we put a new, whole new... Bathroom? Yep. Shower fixtures in here. Yeah. Yay! I'm so excited. I know. Happy Valentine's Day, Dave. <laughs> Get you some flowers tomorrow. Ah, this one's a tight one. That's why you get arthritis, eh? Mm-hmm. Arthritis doing just cleaning pipes. Twist, 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 twist. To thank everyone out there for all of your um, support listening to us. If you can share this, I'd really appreciate it. Take care of each other out there, and we'll talk to you again soon, okay? Bye-bye. I'm going in. Okay, going in.